Hi guys, uh, I'm here to talk about E-Prime today. So uh, today we're going to be looking at E-DataAid. So let's say you have just finished up your experiment in E-Studio. You come in here and you go into E-DataAid and you go into File, Open, and you find your file from E-Studio and you open it and it will give you all your data from your previous bit, um, experiment you did in eStudio. Now the first thing you're going to want to do in getting here is filter your data. With the experiment I did, um, I'm going to do a target ACC filter, and then when you, when you do that, go into your checklist, and click 1, hit OK, and you have your filter, you'll notice they're down here. Moving on, uh, we're going to analyze um, some of this data. Uh, you can give it a name, um, mean of gender study. The study I was previously doing was a gender study. So moving on, we're going to put our variables in columns. So you take what you need. You have your name, gender, and I'm losing the letter P here. Here we go. And prime gender and prime type, those were what I was looking at, and then you take your subject and you put it in your row, and then you come down to target RT time and you put it in your data, and what that will do is give you a mean, and if I'm correct, yes, you run it, and then it kind of consolidates your data for you, um, you know, you can take a look at it, scroll through, you know, reaction times, uh, the female name, male stimulus, whether it's a positive or negative stimulus. Uh, so let's say you want to plot this on an Excel spreadsheet. You go up here and you hit plot and you hit Excel plot. Now, the first time you bring it up, if Excel is not open, it's going to give you an error message. The way to fix this is close out the error message in here, minimize Excel, close the error message out here, hit Excel plot again, and boom, everything's here. It gives you a nice little chart and the rundown right here. So, now let's say you wanted to export just the text to Excel. So, what you're going to do is close out of this and close out of this. Uh, we're not going to save this right now. Um, you go to File, Export, Export to Excel. Notice you can also export to SPSS and other things, eBrime text. Um, but we're going to go to Excel. We're going to hit OK. And you can save it wherever you want. Just remember where you save it on your hard drive. So I'm going to save this right here. And yeah, I, I already have it saved. So, and then you'll go back into Excel. And what you'll do is you'll go to open. You'll go back to where you saved your file in eDataAid. Make sure you're looking at all files. And here's my data. Go through your wizard. All you have to do is hit next twice and finish and all it's here. Now this is a little messy, this is why we usually use SPSS, and that's about it.